those first graders are just kids. Slightly younger kids. You want to know what's not right? Letting Cousin Bobby play. He's like 50. Hey, I'm 23. It's too late for Cousin Bobby. Hey. But these first graders still have a future. If Cousin Bobby stays, so do the first graders. Hanging out with JP all the time, you forget that most middle schoolers are barbarians and not the cool kind who wear fur underwear. Well, one of us is right and one of us is wrong. That's how the world works. So how are we going to figure this out? It's not like there's some kid in a suit who decides these things. Uh, Everything is fine. Why do I have to be in a suit? Because anyone in a suit is obviously responsible. I ran out of things to say. That's it. Well, I'll tell you what would be responsible. Solving this argument, because I'm about to shoot everyone. That's why we need a kid in a suit. Hey, this kid can help you. Huh? He's got a suit and a strong sense of moral. All right, suit's good enough for me. What are you doing? I can't negotiate a peace treaty between the paintballers. Come on, JP. You wanted to be a responsible older kid? This is your chance to look out for everyone else at the creek by stopping war. Yeah, th this could be big. Maybe they'll even give me a creek peace prize for this. Thank you for joining me today, gentlemen. Paintball Mike, would you like to go first? Uh -um. We, the United Sixth Grade Paintball Federation, want the first graders out of this war. First graders are out. Paintball Benny. Uh, so the guys want to be able to keep the first graders to use as human paint shields and such. The first graders are in. Hey, you just said they were out. Uh, we seem to be at an impasse. How about this? I'm just going to write down a number. Would you be willing to settle for this? Uh, this is just a piece of paper that says 300 on it. OK, you drive a hard bargain. What if I were to add a zero? Now it says zero three hundred. Eh, that's it. No more negotiations. Sounds good to me. Oh, come on, guys. We can work this out. You guys are brothers. You shouldn't be fighting. You should be hugging. I mean, can you guys even remember how this silly war started? Huh, maybe the suit's right. What are we even doing here, Mikey? This isn't us. Oh, wait. <laughs> I remember how it started. You shot Mike in the noo noo. <laughs> that was messed up. The war is back on. It's coming! Get JP out of here! We're stuck and sneaking. Don't worry, I'll save you. Wait for Sue. Oh dang! I don't know what to do. All day I tried to be responsible and not get dirty, and, and now you guys are dirty and I'm responsible. I take a grenade for you no matter what you're wearing. Yeah, you're our friend, with or without the suit. With or without the suit? Then I'll take without the suit. Uh, JP? <laughs> saved our lives. We are forever in your debt. Good job, JP. Oh, hey, Laura! John, Paul, don't you dare tell me you went out in your birthday suit again. Nah, I wore my Sunday suit. You did what? Well, don't worry, I didn't get nothing dirty. <laughs> Very responsible, JP. Somebody put some clothes on that boy! Back off, Carol! His body is beautiful! 